Prince Harry and Prince William spoke briefly at their grandmother's committal service, but to the disappointment of royal watchers, they were off microphone. Here's how the exchange supposedly went down, according to a lip reader. Harry and William have had a rocky relationship over the last few years, and it appears that not even Queen Elizabeth II's death could fully mend their deeply rooted rift. When their grandmother passed away, it appeared the brothers at least put their troubles aside and came together as a family unit. Many royal watchers were interested in observing the brothers' dynamic at the funeral service, prompting lip reader Jackie Press to share with the Daily Mail what the princes were saying to each other. As the embattled brothers and their wives went to enter the pews for the committal service, Harry allegedly asked William, "'Shall we go through first? William nodded his head yes before reportedly telling his wife, Kate Middleton, let them go through first. Middleton allegedly said okay as Harry and Markle walked past her and her children. Not exactly the most exciting exchange, but the civility on display may signal hope for the family as the brothers work on mending their relationship. The trouble between Harry and William seemed to have started when rumors swirled that there was drama unfolding between their wives, the Duchess of Sussex, Meghan Markle, and the now Princess of Wales, Kate Middleton, which has since been confirmed. She was upset about something pertaining to, yes, the issue was correct, about flower girl dresses, and it made me cry. Though there were further claims made that Kate was bullying Meghan or that the trouble was just between the women, a source shared that it was William and Harry, in fact, who were truly at odds. Royal filmmaker Nick Bullen told Fox News in 2019, "...it's actually that William and Harry have had a rift. All brothers fall out, all families fall out. Their fallout at the moment is becoming public." Things have not seemed to improve with time. The funeral for their beloved grandmother could have been a turning point for their struggling relationship. One inside source told Us Weekly, "...the Queen's funeral gave the royals a window of opportunity to heal as a family. They know it's what the Queen would have wanted and are trying to move forward from the past." While the princes clearly haven't repaired their fractured relationship, there is still hope. In fact, body language expert Judy James believes that Harry regrets the rift between him and his brother. James told The Sun, "...during the service, Harry was dabbing tears as well as tending to look around a lot, and there were at least two occasions when his gaze, that was more of a stare, appeared directed at William. His expression suggested sadness and possible regret." And as they prepared to march behind the coffin again, Harry showed his most emotional display, according to James, who added, "...standing in line, he watched as the brother he had once been so close to, the nephew he had adored playing with, and the sister-in-law he had viewed as his own sister, filed in front of him with not one glance in his direction." Hopefully, the brothers will put more work in on healing their rift in time for King Charles III's coronation.